today we'll be seeing first come first serve this problem we have processes that are uh, p1 p2 p3 p4 there are arrival time from 0 to 3 and burst time accordingly now let's see what is first come first serve first come first serve is an algorithm where the first process would come and complete its execution completely until unless the next process arrives to your ready queue so the first step is to draw the gang chart okay so a point to remember is always the gang chart starts from 0th millisecond based on our table the arrival time 0 starts from process 1 that has a burst time of 9 so considering it we draw p1 here till the 9th millisecond next process 2 arrives at first milliseconds having burst time 4 so we add p2 then we add here as 13 that is 9 plus 4 now the next process having burst time as 9 that is p3 p3 which has a burst time of 9 so therefore 13 plus 9 next p4 arrives at third millisecond having burst time 5 this will be 22 plus 5 7 now our gang chart is ready now to check whether our gang chart we have drawn it correctly or not that's one way to check it out we have to sum all the burst times you might use a calculator for this simply 9 plus 4 plus 9 plus 5 27 so is our gang chart totally 27 yes so we have not encountered any error while drawing the gang chart now the second step is to calculate average waiting time Alright. Hit the subscribe button. And hit the bell icon to never miss a video from Future Vision BIE. Waiting time of process P1. How do we know the process waiting time of processes? So on the gang chart we have to see to the leftmost thing that is the waiting time of process p1 so p1 waits for 0 milliseconds to execute its processes so p1 waits for 0 milliseconds while p2 waits for 9 milliseconds now p3 p3 waits for 13 milliseconds same p4 waits for 22 milliseconds so sum of all zero plus nine plus thirteen plus twenty two that is forty four forty four forty four by number of things P1, P2, P3, P4, that is 4. By 4. 
by 4 11 therefore average waiting time is 11 milliseconds